Freedom! Stop looking at the couch. This is gonna get weird. Freedom! Today I wanted to talk to you about... No, no, wait. I wanted to talk to you about a few updates that I have for you. As many of you know, lately I've been working more and more in the sponsorship -y type department. And a lot of sponsorships, as I'm coming to find out, is a lot about information. Getting information to people. So that's kind of what I'm trying to do here. So because this was pre-recorded, some of this information may not be the newest or the freshest. So try to bear with me. There may be stuff in here you don't know, or maybe stuff that you didn't take action on the first time you heard. I can't believe I just said... You heard. I feel like I'm back in the 80s. So first and foremost, the thing I wanted to make you the most aware of is a YouTube channel here on YouTube called Creator Insider. I've been watching this now for about a month, but I haven't really made a video on it because it's one of those things where they give you information kind of like we give you information. So they're kind of competition, but kind of not. Um, so it is sort of a an unofficial YouTube project type thing. Uh, so it's definitely a great place to get information for channels such as yourselves. So be sure to subscribe to that link in the description down below. It's run by a guy named Tom, and he's really kind of cool. So check him out. He's got access to all kinds of really cool people and uh, all kinds of really cool information. And he tries to come and like at least once a week talk to like some they're not subscribers but like creators and stuff support's been having all kinds of questions about monetization which is fair which is fine so let's see if we can demystify that as many people are aware earlier this year somewhere between february and april there was this whole ad apocalypse thing that you know turned a bunch of people into like you know zombies <laughs> actually no um but speaking of this shirt actually uh freedom just recently updated its uh merchandise uh, link in the description to Spreadshirt where you can check out what else we have. Uh, I actually wanted this one to say I survived the zombie ad apocalypse, but I got overruled on that one. Still an awesome shirt though. I got sidetracked. Um, oh yeah, so the couple of changes to monetization and the way that that works. So uh, there was a bug that you, well, YouTube says it's a bug where some users were seeing the green monetization symbol even though they didn't have 10,000 lifetime views on their channel. Uh, and they claim that there wasn't any monetization going on. I don't have any tangible real proof of this, um, but that's what they say, uh, and that that should be fixed here soon. So if you've got less than 10,000 views on your channel in total, and you stop seeing that little green um, monetized symbol in the next couple of weeks, just remember it really shouldn't have been monetizing since April. Now, when it comes to monetization, uh, as many people may be aware, now there's a system when you upload a video on your My Videos page, it'll give you like a little green symbol or a little uh, like a gray symbol, or it'll give you like a yellow symbol. Uh, yellow means that it's not monetized for all, uh, or not safe for all advertisers. And you can, uh, you can appeal that process. Uh, green means you're A-OK, -okay, and gray, I think, means it's claimed or not monetized at all. I forget at the moment. I should have made a better note on that. So anyways, what I wanted to talk to you about is an appeal when it's yellow. So if you see a little yellow monetization icon, uh, the way that that works is you have to have to appeal it the way it used to work <laughs> up till now is you could upload it as unlisted and uh, the, the channel or YouTube would take a look at that. Uh, if you left it un as unlisted for a little while, they would review it uh, and then they would either set it as good to go or not. Um, now, they, don't, uh, they, they do that for channels over 10,000 subscribers uh, or channels under 10,000 subscribers who hit 1,000 views in the first week of the um, video's existence or something very similar to that. Again, my, my, my notes, I, I should do better. I do still very highly suggest, and I have for a very long time, that people who upload videos to YouTube have a catalog of unlisted videos that they can release whenever. It gives you a great buffer in case you need to take a couple of days off or like a week off or depending on your schedule. Um, I try to keep three videos on my personal channel as unlisted at all times. For me, that has come in really good handy while dealing with all this uh, monetization stuff because I can release what YouTube isn't demonetizing while I 
try to fix everything else. And who doesn't like a buffer? It's nice to have when things go wrong. YouTube also recently announced an ultra low latency mode, which can get you as low as a one second delay between the streamer and the streamy. Stream, is, is a streamy a thing? This is awesome for everyone who's doing live streaming. However, I have to be honest, YouTube right now with all the uh, demonetization stuff, um, you're, you're, you're not really, I, this is a great feature from my personal opinion. It's a great feature, but there are a lot of gamers right now who are really cheesed off because they're not allowed to monetize their streams because of all this, you know, other monetization craziness. So I don't know. Like I'm just saying there's, there's something to be fixed here. And that's all the notes that I have for you for now. And let me know in the comment section down below if I've missed anything, if there have been any other news uh, thingies that I should have covered. Uh, and I'd like to thank uh, a lot of people on our community team and on the forums, uh, specifically Ashley Silverdust, who brought to my attention the ultra low latency bit of news. Uh, and I believe if you would have been paying attention over on the forums, you probably would have known that like four days ahead of time, or maybe, maybe more. I don't know when this video is going to go out, but you would have known it sooner. <laughs> Anyways, I hope this video has been helpful for you. If it has, let us know in the comments section down below. Till next time, don't forget to like, subscribe, and do all those things that make us love our jobs. Also, be awesome to yourself and amazing to each other. Bye. Freedom Family, during the end card, I wanted to introduce you to this guy. This guy is Bobby, and uh, he is an unsung hero of Freedom. Pretty much anything that needs to be done, he does it. Anyway, yeah, so uh, click on something.